I don't know. I mean, seven strong innings. Made a mistake on Dozier. You know, kind of flew up in a little bit and came around to change up and location wasn't very good. It ended up down and in and he ended up hitting a two-run homer on it. But outside of that, I just thought he pitched great. Pretty much in control, wasn't he? Oh, yeah, he was in control. I mean, uh, did a good job. Uh, you, you know, did a good job with his pitch count. Um, you know, really good breaking ball. Really good change up um, for the most part. Stayed within himself really, really well. It's a nice performance. Um, Sal gets the big hit there, too. On, uh, yeah, it was, it was a big hit. <laughs> yeah. A jam shot. But I mean, those are the kind of breaks you haven't been getting. No, I know. I mean, no. And those are the kind of breaks that were kind of been going against us here a little bit. And, you know, to, to, to you know, finally take the lead back, on, you know, on that hit was a big hit. But that's what happens when you put the ball in play. You, got, you get guys in scoring position and you find ways to put the ball in play. It doesn't have to be pretty. Um, you know, it just has to be effective, and that certainly was effective. That at bat, I think, was down 0-2 in the count. Right. Uh, on two sliders yeah. off the plate down. And he did a good job of laying off a couple of more and then threw a fastball up and in and, you know, muscled it over the third baseman's head. Got your tack on and runs, too. Yeah, which is always nice. I mean, that keeps, you know, our bullpen. You know, Herrera's been up. You know, he pitched two two days in a row and then got hot yesterday in, in Duffy's game just in case we need him. So I was doing everything I could to stay away from him tonight, you know, just give him a breather. And our plan was to have Strom face Kepler, and then Jack was going to come in, and uh, it worked out perfectly.